We're back on Primal Fear, and this time we're starting from the beginning of Wipe and aiming on surviving. My goal is pretty simple, become the alpha of the server and experience everything Primal Fear has to offer. But before we can get there, we need to start on the beach. We are back on Primal Fear, and this time we are starting fresh. Um, yeah, we now know what we're doing. Uh, no more of running around having no clue what we're doing. So we're gonna go ahead and we're just gonna we're just gonna vibe. We're gonna have a good time. We're gonna tame as many things as we can. And honestly, I'm looking at making a series out of this. You guys have shown some insane support on the last two Primal Fear videos, and a lot of you guys asked for a full series. So that's exactly what I'm gonna give you. Yeah, I think the only only plan going forward I have right now is to do one as much rating as possible. Two, build a massive base. And three, just have a good time. So, I think what we learned from last time is bases aren't really that safe at all. So, I'm probably going to go ahead and build the same type of sky base we had in the last video. Uh, probably in a corner and just make it massive. Because, why not? <laughs> um, but yeah, let's just get the levels we need. Yo. Um. Yo. <laughs> what? It's not cool, man. Goodbye, friend. Actually, hold on. Let me find crystal. Let me find some crystal. There's a mana core over there. Right, let's go in here. I think it'll survive. It might not survive, but if I can get crystal, I can cryo it. Crystal. I need crystal. There's some crystal. Alright. We have enough for cryos. Just get one. Try to cry out without getting hit, and we can just run away. Oh, never mind. <laughs> Rip. After scouting around and some unfortunate mishaps with my PT, I decided to get settled down. Alright, I'm not gonna bother sitting on that PT, it's way too quick. But let's just go ahead, I think this is a good height, what's the final height here? Yeah, that's fine, we're gonna make ourselves one big box in the corner, I think. And, um... Then we're just gonna surround it with floating turrets pretty much everywhere else. So, we'll have, like, a wall. Here, we need... Let's see how big our... We don't really need much space on the inside, to be honest. There's not really much we need other than just... Crafting structures and storage space. So, oh, did not mean to do that. Let's get ourselves... There we go. But I mean, yeah, that's 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 our box. It's a pretty big spot. Uh, let's get ourselves some of these guys queued up. One of these guys, and then if we ever want to leave, we can just open it up, and we're good to go. All right, but we need to get ourselves turrets, so we are gonna pop the turret kit. But first, we are gonna put our replicator down right in the corner. That seems the best spot for it. I can't even see the corner. Corner's like here, I think. That works. All right, and there we go. That is pretty much our base. It looks a little scuffed just because, well, I can't uh, really put turrets <laughs> higher than that. Uh, I kind of messed up with that, but that being said, it's pretty much defended. You're not going to be able to uh, go much higher than that. Or really do much. Even if you do get higher than that, you're still going to get shot by everything. And there's plenty of turrets under. Most of these will shoot under anyway. So we are good to do. So I am just going to work on ammo now and getting everything situated with the crafting station. 
All right, so we are pretty good on the base front now. We have everything going. We have every bench blueprint learner, automatic crafters going to get ourselves a bunch of ARB teleporters, a place to store our cryopods, and pretty much everything you can ask for. With the base built in a pretty strong spot, it was time to start working towards getting kibble. Guy on a Bronto right there, I think. You know what? I'm gonna try something stupid here. Okay. I think I'm gonna kill this guy. Cause it should just be two shots. I'm gonna land to do it though. I'm just gonna I'm just gonna tap him. I have a very OP rifle, so. He's dead. Ronto's coming after me, but we should be able to just kite him away. All right, please have some juice on you. Ooh, that's okay. We're we're going home. That's actually kind of juice. It's actually kind of juice. Cause I need those injectors. And just go over here and TP back to base. I didn't even look exactly what we got, but all right. Yeah, we got the HP injectors. Those are huge because I believe, are they in here? No, no they're an internal um, consumables, potions. Okay, so these were added. So these aren't as big of a deal as I'm making them out to be. The last time we played, it wasn't possible to get these, so maybe it was through donations or something prior, but now I guess you're able to get them. They're not super OP, but it is nice to get those. I feel kind of stupid for being super uh, happy about getting that, but it is kind of cool. There we go. Finally. Alright, now we just need to get Mejos. Perfect. Throw that in there. There we go. Something's definitely glitched with that, but as long as we got Tame Helper, it doesn't really matter too much. Alright. Let's get ourselves a bunch of seeds. Definitely does not work. All right, I'll just harvest this way. It'll still work just fine. So we should be able to craft that pretty easily. Yep. Perfect. With the kibble made and progress going smoothly, it was time to start taming. Uh, yep, there it is. Perfect. Alright, I don't know if I'm gonna be able to net it, but I brought nets, so, uh... I guess we'll find out. Okay, I'll rip my uh, tech suit. That's fine. Didn't need it anyway. Okay, you can't net them. It's unfortunate. I guess we'll just tame both of them. Ow. It's fine. I got potions and stuff, man. You hurt, though, a lot. I'm gonna have to cry out that PT real quick. He's gonna kill it. Nope, cry out. Okay. 
Why do you gotta be so rude, man? I know I'm still just a bob right now, but you can at least make my job a little easier by letting me tame you. You might knock out in one. These don't have much torp for. Hit him again, there we go. Alright, this isn't the one we wanted to tame, but we have plenty of kibble, so I'm just going to go ahead and tame it. And I forgot my tame helper. There we go. Perfect. And now let's go ahead and find where the other one went to, and we'll tame him up as well. There he is. And we have ourselves a level 779 Electric Griffin. Beautiful. Alright, let's put this baby to work. Let's get some uh, points into move speed. We'll go to 300 well, once we get all the levels. Kill some stuff real quick. It will go 300 move speed. Go to that much stamina's. And we'll put all these points into melee, and then we'll put points into HP after we get some more levels. It's a demonic echo. It's probably not the best thing to try to kill when I'm not fully leveled, so. Right here, the horse. Yeah, 1.4 million damage. That seems about right. All right, let's try to kill this. It's gonna be rough, but we need the primal blood to be able to make celestial kibble, so it's really our only, our only hope. Uh, oh, whatever, it's all right. There we go, got our primal blood. Let's go. Primal health potion, you can't even craft those. That's, that's really good. Um, okay, well, we're gonna go home right away. All right, this time I am just going to cryo the griffin and Hover above it with the tech suit. Because that seems like a better idea since the griffin is pretty unpredictable. That should knock it out pretty easily, to be honest. These are the second best arrows in the game, I'm pretty sure, so yeah. With ease. So we'll go ahead, throw the kibble in there, throw this in there, eat that, tame up. Boom! There we go. Throw this on him, and we are good to go. We got ourselves a Giga. Let's get some levels going in him. I think I'm actually going to tame this Prime Karaku while I'm here. Just because that seems like a smart idea. Oh, it needs insta-tame meat. I didn't even realize that. Actually, it don't, doesn't need insta-tame meat. Can use the other meat. Oh, I just knocked out the morale tops. Alright. I get eternal prime meat. I'm gonna go ahead and go back to base real quick. Nice. Alright, we got ourselves a prime Karakou. Not sure if this is going to be helpful with raiding, but I do know that the Penguino and the... There's another Karaku that does work very well for raiding. So I figured, why not tame it? It was right next to me. It seemed very... Wanting to be tamed. Alright, well we should be able to tame this with one arrow. Hopefully. I cry on my griffin just in case... Stuff goes wrong. As it very well might. 
but we hit him. And he should knock out. I'm not gonna move, because nothing's happening, and I want it to stay that way. I don't want him to, like, special attack me and just insta-kill me. So I'm just gonna chill. <laughs> he should knock out in one arrow, and then we'll be good. Beautiful. Alright, and then we'll throw the spirit orb in there. And we got ourselves a spirit rex. Forgot to grab the saddle for it, but go back to base and grab that now. There is a Celestial Indominus Rex Emperor there that I kind of want to try to kill. Could be fun. Alright, we got a bite. We got like a thingy. We shoot a ball that shoots more balls. We like that. Oh, I think that's it. Oh, jeez. We just did 13 million damage. Okay. There's a Celestial Indominus Rex here. I'm going to try to just... Just shoot balls at it and hope for the best. Oh, no. Mistakes were made. I mean, I'm doing a lot of damage, but it's going to kill me off the top. I need to do damage to the boss. Okay, I just did a bunch. That's good. If I can land a ball on top, that should be good. That should be huge. Come on. Do a bunch of damage here. There we go. Huge damage. Huge damage. Yes. Let's go. Alright. That worked a lot better than I thought it would. I'm not going to lie. But we got ourselves the Celestial Emperor Soul, the Summoner, which is what I really wanted. Because that's big. Although, seeing the power of this Rex, I'm not sure if we even want to summon it. Although, I will take Celestial Blade. Because that, that is really cool. Now that we had some pretty strong tames, it was time to start farming bosses and getting ourselves some better gear. I'm already on fire. There we go. Oh yeah, we're doing a lot of damage to him. A lot of damage. There we go. Alright. I don't think it helps that I'm constantly just shitting, but... Be nice if I wasn't. <laughs> I can't move. I think the, the potions are uh, messing me up a bit here. Well, it is taking damage. It's the hard mode, so it's going to take a lot less. Okay, can we stop with the, the shits? You know, it is a lot harder to uh, kill the bosses now, but... This isn't too bad. We'll make it work. There we go. What spawned? Monkey. That's fine. Although it's hard mode. That's not preferred. Nothing on the floor. No bags from the previous bosses. Alright, let's spawn in the Reaper Empress. Hello, my friend. And, uh, you're already burying. I'm just gonna kite you into turrets, I think, is the best, best situation here. 
Although, we'll see. I don't know how much damage the turrets are gonna- Oh, they're doing plenty of damage to them. Not the same as the photons, but enough. Definitely enough. Although I'm gonna run out of ammo. These Daydons are tanky. Is there a bag from the Reaper Empress? Ooh, this character body. Oh, the Reaper Empress body is all the way over there. Didn't even notice. Alright, what do we got? Mm, ooh, mystical demonic legs. Alright. Never seen those before. Those are pretty cool looking. I mean, I'm doing damage. Not sure about how much, but... No, I wasn't watching my own HP. That's really bad. Or just maybe even hop on him. Alright, we're good, we're good. Yeah, we're good. I just gotta keep an eye on my own HP. Alright, I think we got this. I think we got this. We definitely got this. He's dead. Oh my. Okay. Okay. I have like two frames. I can't believe we just did that. I can't believe we actually did that. Okay, well this was definitely the strategy there. That does so much damage. Um, so someone was stalking me, and I think he might have grabbed my body. Um. Come on. I don't know if he grabbed it, but I got his stuff. scary here goes nothing 23 billion HP and he's spawning on top of me
That could be a problem. The no stamina could be a problem. Can I get stamina? Is it gonna let me? There we go. Well, just one hit should kill it. There we go. There we go. I was a little worrying. I was a little worried, but we did get the torch. Everything is good. Everything is good. With all the bosses killed and having some of the best gear in the game now, it was time to start raiding. Alright, what do we got going on? Like, that's old, so it's just in the back. Cause this, this was here yesterday. Whatever this is. Yeah, I mean, I see the Jenny right there. He's sleeping. I mean, he's not rich, but I guarantee you, if I don't do this, someone else is going to. So... Yeah, I guess. I guess I'll do it. I'm gonna try to... Alright, and that's down. I'm not gonna break anything if I don't have to. I just wanna see what he's got. And to be honest, I need to get resource. It's just a bunch of free resources, so... Why not? I don't want to have to break this, but... Leave me no choice, man. Nothing. Alright, well... I'll leave his stuff, I'll leave his turrets, I'll leave his PT. But I will take the free resources, because free resources, resources is always nice. Ooh, someone's writing this right now. Where's he at? He's in there just destroying it. Okay. He's on the back of the griffin. I can tap him off. I'm quick. I need a good angle, man. I'm going to try to get above him. He shouldn't be able to see much because of all the wreckage. If I can kill him quick, run up Torch's Griffin, you know, that's like best case scenario. I gotta be careful here. Killed him. Okay, I got his kit. Torpor mode. It's dead. It's big. Alright. I was just coming over here to raid this, too. It's worth it. Come here, buddy. You know you want the smoke. I just killed him off. Dude just got rolled. 
I don't know how I just killed him off, but I did. That was big. Alright. Let's take what I want out of this. I can't shoot him off the top. There we go. I got him. Let's go. He's literally just naked. Prim saddle on the thing now too. Oh, Celestium Dominus Rex. Hello, buddy. Let's see how you fare. Probably not so good, to be honest. Yep, you're dead. You don't really stand a chance against this, to be fair. It's just... <laughs> it's OP. It does percent damage, so it just shreds through everything. Okay, well the base is right there. Is that not in the mesh? has to literally be in the mesh. It's in the mesh. This base... It's in the mesh. Somehow I'm still chilling. Not really sure how, because this isn't where I was supposed to end up, but... I'm here. <laughs> If it's right there. Alright, let's see if we can't just splash it, I guess. Oh, 
All down. All down. Beautiful. Alright, let's see what kind of goodies we got. Okay. Lots of resources. Go ahead and take all of that right off the rip. Why not? Uh, crystal, some blood, feathers, hide, more resources. Ice Colossus Medallion, Alien PT Egg, a bunch of Wyvern Eggs, just take everything out of there. Weapon Workbench, PT, Turrets, Ammo, Resources, Apex Egg. With our little raiding spree coming to an end, I headed to sleep and woke up the next morning ready to continue raiding, but first, it was time to hatch a few eggs. Okay, now back to raiding. Well, I didn't mean to do that, but I guess we're doing that. Okay, well, they can take damage. I mean, I guess I'm just gonna go for it. Someone else is gonna do it if I don't, so... Why not? A little free, uh, loot. Do they even have turrets? They don't even have turrets. Like, I feel bad doing this, but I know if I don't, someone else is just going to roll through them, so. They have a lot of stuff placed. Alright, well, let's break everything. Alright, let's see what we get. It's a bunch of tech walls. We'll take it. Why not? Primal Smithy. A lot of resources. We'll take it all. Honestly. I don't want that bow, though. <laughs> Alright, we'll take all the resources. Why not? Always useful. Nothing else from there. Uh, take the TP. And the vaults. Uh, take all that, take that, alright, well I mean that was kind of shit, but, you know, like I said, I don't want to do that per se, but I know if I don't do that, there is going to be another tribe that's going to come along and do it themselves, so. With those four raids finished, I was doing pretty good. But if I wanted to become the best on the server, I would need to step up my game and raid bigger and better bases. But that's a story for another day. We're back on Primal Fear, and in the last part, we built up and got ourselves to the point where we were ready to start raiding. And that's what we did. We raided a couple bases, but today I wanted to raid even bigger bases and start exploring the complex world of Primal Fear. So, let's start in the desert, where I found an online base. Okay, well, I completely forgot about this base, but this base is still here. So we are going to raid this. Because it should be a fun one. Um, yeah, I completely forgot this was here. What's the tribe name? Okay. Um, they had a bunch of tames yesterday, so hopefully they still have some tames, or at least some crowd tames. We can get a few new ones. That'd be cool. Let's place this... Limit of 10 reached. Oh my god. Alright, it just looks like a bunch of turrets. The generator's probably down below, I'd imagine. If we can get somewhere near that and then just go straight for the jenny, it should be relatively easy. I think it's in that back corner over there. Alright, we're just gonna have to 
poke around. Is that it right there? I can't tell if that's it or a soul terminal. There's something to the right over there that I can't really see. I'm just gonna... Okay. Gun didn't want to shoot there for a second. Oh, he's online. He is online. Okay. That changes things a bit. Yep, he just popped the thing. Alright, I don't want to just... I want to raid, but I can't really raid without, like, a spirit griffin or something. Like, I can bring a spirit rex to kill him, but... Okay, so we have this full fob. Let's hope this goes well. Hopefully he doesn't see me while I'm placing the fob. Be worst case scenario there, but... If I can get this fob down without him noticing... And we're golden. doesn't need to be anything special just literally a bunch of turrets all over the place I just got to be careful now once we are raiding not to die and lose my kit I don't have backup kits made well, that wouldn't be hard but gonna roll through these turrets. I don't like this blue orb thing. Makes it hard to see. Well, he's there. He just whistled. He's doing. What's he doing? I'm a little nervous because I have no idea what the dude's doing. He's using a shitty fabby, that's for sure. He already got his body back. Alright, well I gotta keep an eye out. I'm gonna keep an eye on that cinema crops. I don't think he realizes that I can literally just tap him every time he does that. He just shot me there for a lot of damage. I gotta be careful now. He's got a good Fabby. 
I think I'm just gonna send the Celestial. Spirit Rex. I don't know if he respawned or not. Maybe he's out of beds. I'm gonna risk it. It's not all down. Shit. I gotta spawn in quick. No, he got my kit. That blows. There we go, I got him, but is his body gonna fall quick enough is the question. Ah, uh, he got it. I gotta be careful. already forced him out. He's over the ocean right now. Come on, just spawn me in quickly this time, please. I don't want to lose another kit. Come on. There we go. He got shot a bunch of times. Let's go. He almost got my kit. He almost got my kit. At once. Twice. It's so hard to trace that. All down. All down. I don't have a torch on me.
Alright, well, I mean, I have his loot. I have everything. I don't have a torch on me to break all of this shit. I'm just gonna... Kinda just try to do what I can do here. I'd imagine he has my torch on him. So... Kinda makes things awkward there. We finally got in, so that's nice. Soul traps, a bunch of soul traps. Bunch of element. Yeah, nothing too crazy there. Definitely has my torch on him though. So annoying. That's like the one thing, if I could get one thing back, it'd be the torch. <laughs> Can't really leave, or he's just gonna place a new gen down. He's right there. I'm going for him. There we go. Let's go. Huge. Come on, come on. Move the body. Beautiful. See my torch? Here's my torch. And all of my gear. Alright, let's start running through these turrets. Let's go. That was a pretty intense online, I'm not gonna lie. Thought it was gonna be a lot easier for an online and... He put up a, a good defense. You know, he didn't really have the dinos to challenge me, but... He got that Fabian put in the work. Alright. Everything is broken. Let's just loot now. And dip. Um, anything we need out of there? Not really. All these BPs are pretty. Just dino BPs. Don't need any of that. We'll take the crystals. Celestial soul. Then from there. Element feathers. This guy. This guy. Origin tribute. Definitely. Uh... Okay, I don't know what that is, but I'll take it. <laughs> um, bunch of stuff here. Coins, definitely. Transmitters. Fabby. Um, yeah, some resources. Blood. Upgrade station, take all that. Blueprint add-on station. Take all that. I'm gonna check that. Replicator. Um, blood, the origin tributes, definitely. These guys. Resources. Yeah, not nothing really. Primal Smithy? Ooh, okay. Uh, ammo. Origin Tributes, definitely. PT. Feathers. Blood. Uh, we'll take the Celestial. The saddle. Uh, some Cinema Crops. 
Thank you. Ooh, boss essence. We actually need that. We didn't have any for some reason. Uh, all the pre-crafted saddles. All of this. Alright. That is a very successful raid. Um, I commend the guy for putting up the fight. That made it a lot of fun. I'm not going to lie. It was a very fun raid. With that online finished and being a little more difficult than I originally thought, I took the loot home and continued my raiding spree on Ragnarok. What is going on here? It's just a couple turrets. Are these all heavies? I mean, if they are literally all heavies, I can just walk in there. I'm just gonna... Where's my tech chest? We'll see how this goes. <laughs> and that is why you use every type of turret. <laughs> uh, that's funny. Yeah, there's nothing here. I just wanted to do that. That was fun. Ooh, I see a red bubble coming from this cave. Someone built in it? I'm gonna be smart. Yeah, there's definitely something in it. Let's see, can I K cam and see turrets? Yeah, there's definitely turrets. Alright, we're gonna we're gonna place some stuff down. There's a lot of turrets in there. There's a bunch here, but I should be able to I'm just gonna open up a foundation here. And then use it basically. Just tech rifle through everything, I guess. Hope for the best. Do I have rockets on me? Alright, this is a little awkward because it's water, but... I think we did pretty decent amount of damage there. Oh, I forgot to reload. This is so awkward because of this, like, messed up mesh. Ooh. I think it's honestly just going to be easier to do. The rifle. Yeah, the rifle's just easier. This ORP definitely hurts. That's for sure. Or doesn't hurt, but... Makes it a little difficult to raid. Things take a lot more damage. There's a lot of turrets in there, but I think we'll be fine. The fact that heavies just don't do anything is hilarious to me. Alright. Well, there is a Jenny there, but I'd imagine it's not the only Jenny. Okay. Well, I don't know if the server just lagged or if... I just found the spot, but... Definitely splashing. I got a lot of turrets that last one. Oh, we might not have to keep running in. We can maybe just send them in. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that second rocket is basically just getting in there. 
I can't see. I gotta wait for records here. Alright, I'm just gonna put on backspace so we can see. Oh, hello. Okay. Where does this guy come from? He's just out of nowhere. Shows up. And then disappears. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> is that like an Ovis spawner? <laughs> like, what is going on? He's literally coming out of nowhere, showing up. <laughs> Whatever. Oh, I put a hole in the wall. Okay. <laughs> what scares you the most in life? Mesh sheep. <laughs> Alright, let's just <laughs> tech rifle the rest of these down. Maybe we can make our way to the generator. Yeah, I think that's the... They built this in a, like, a kind of a bad way. What the heck? Like, if they would have just made it a little farther back, they would have been fine. Dude, sheep, can you stop? Sheep are more of a pain to deal with than the base, to be honest. And, like, it wouldn't be bad if they just, like... There must be, like, some type of thing. Some, like, defense where they just, like, show up. And then they hit you, and then they despawn. Hey, yo, chill, man. Alright, well, we're pretty much in now. Put all the turrets. I think it's all the turrets. I think this is... No, wait, what is it? There's, like, a defense thing. Oh. Stop! Alright. Come here. Well, now I'm stuck in the sheep. And this sheep is loaded on gear. <laughs> Nothing I really need, though, but... What the heck? <laughs> what is going on? Oh, no. I'm stuck in the sheep, and the sheep is just... Too OP. Oh, I... Actually, it's doing a decent amount of damage. We'll just keep going at it. Alright. Can I get out of here now, man? Thank you. Alright. Structure damage. <sighs> okay, that didn't mean to do that much damage, but... I guess let's just break everything. And then... I won't break their crop plot. That's just rude. Ooh, he's a bunch of potions on him. Take all the potions. Uh, the bow and stuff. There we go. Alright. Well, let's get to looting, I suppose. A robot griffin? Very nice. We will gladly take that. I think that's better than the griffin we have now. A bunch of potions. 
some crystals, sword, whatever. Take the bow and the fabby. Okay. We're in a workbench. Uh, we'll take the boots BP. Why not? All this alpha meat. All of this. And then we'll just take like two stacks of green crystals. Smithy. Don't really need that. We'll take the resources. Wow, okay. We will take all of these eggs. Pretty much all of these potions. Let me just type in. We'll take all of these. I don't want the other ones. But all these fabled. We'll gladly take. Um, yeah, we'll take the ammo. Why not? Alright, let's take all of these. So much origin narcotic. Very nice. We'll take it all. Uh, vault. Ooh, okay. Celestial Griffin. Beautiful. I think that's a Reaper boss. Celestial Ferox. Thank you. Shards. We'll take all the shards. Uh, Demonic Egg. Another Reaper, I'm pretty sure. A bunch of potions. Um, gear and weapons and resources. Potions. I think we're good. There was a soul terminal here, but there wasn't anything in it. But yeah, it was a good raid. It was a good raid. After raiding those two bases, I took my scouting both to the air and the sea. Well, uh, not really sure what the best case, or the best way to go about this is, but I think my first try, I'm just gonna... And do something like that. You know, that could be a play right there. Just to get the bubble down. Try to go up into the where that um the forge or the grinder is. I'm getting shot through everything. Yeah, I mean... That's not really working too well. I think the turrets above shoot and then I get shot through like the grill and shit. Maybe go in front like I was before. But if we get a turret every time, you know, the same thing that happened on the lion cave in the uh, previous one. If we get a turret every time, you know, eventually... We're in the base. I think I'm getting shot through the bottom. If I can get these turrets up top. Okay.
Come on. I'm probably going to insta-die after I do this, but... Come on! <laughs> okay. Well, I mean, we got the... We got it out. I think we got that generator. I don't know. Oh my gosh. No way. I thought this was going to, honestly, I thought this was going to be so much harder. But I mean, I think we did a pretty good job at uh, doing it the right way. <laughs> let's go. All right, let's grab some of this stuff. Good rifle. Beautiful. All right, we're good. All right, let's check the rep. Got a PT, a bunch of shards. Beautiful, some blood, boss essence, a Bronto, bunch of resources, gladly take. Um, yeah, just all these resources. Thank you very much. Yeah, that was a nice little raid. Nothing too crazy, but loot wise, but it was fun. It was definitely fun. So we'll keep scouting and keep looking for more raids. No run up, no nothing, just go straight into here. Okay, well we got we got what we wanted. And we're good. We're good here. This is literally exactly what I wanted to happen. Now I am doing damage to the thing. That's what I'm worried about, is I'm gonna do damage to Let me try to Maybe close it? Nope, it's not gonna let me. I wanna hit this down, but I think I'm gonna pop open this entire thing. Yep. Alright, well that didn't work well. All right, and as soon as this bubble goes down, we are gonna go for the generator. And then hopefully, that's it. Come on. All down. All down, baby. All down. Let's go. All right, let's loot this guy. He's, he died. All right. Weapons workbench, take all that. Some ammo. All right. We are in. Wow. Okay. Let's go ahead. Let's start breaking stuff. Let's get the loot. All right. Let's see. What did we get? Any juice? Is there's just nothing in this base? Holy shit! What was that? Oh my god! He just scared the shit out of me! Who is this? Oh my gosh! I can't, my heart. My heart. Was he watching me do that the whole time? Oh, come on. Where did the guy go? Dude, he scared me so bad.
I'm just gonna take all. I don't even know what's in there, but... Yeah, I don't think this raid was too profitable. Well, I mean, we didn't lose anything, but too... Too much loot. <laughs> What was that guy doing, man? Well, I was just coming up from scouting the water, and I basically just flew into this base. I wasn't recording, but... Um... What? I mean, I guess we're just gonna go raid it real quick. There's a lot of egg incubators there, so... Maybe we'll get lucky and, uh... Okay, there's an under... thingy. Hey, maybe we'll get lucky and get some eggs from this. I'm trying to figure out where the Jenny is. Okay. That was really close. That was very, very close. go. Alright. That was a successful... I don't know. Ah, uh, it's not what I wanted to do. Well, I have a feeling anything that was here is um, now despawned. Uh, he's got a lot of loot on him, though, so, um... Guess we'll loot that. Yeah. I'm not seeing any bags, so that's unfortunate, but, uh... We did get a little bit of stuff, so not too bad. With those six raids finished, I felt pretty good. But my raiding spree wouldn't stop here. I wanted to continue until there wasn't a single base left on the server. But that story is one for another day. Until next time. Today we're back on Primal Fear, and you guessed it, we're back to raiding, with one goal in mind, raid the entire cluster, and hopefully explore everything Primal Fear has to offer. Today's journey starts in the sky, where I just found a sky base. Okay, well, I was just flying the border, um, over there, and a piece of this base just rendered in, just out of nowhere, and de-rendered, de like, instantly, and, um, yeah. This is a, uh, a pretty thick base, and there is not a single turret on it, so <laughs> I'm a little confused, but, um, definitely a juicer of a base, so I'm looking for players right now, I don't see anybody, they're cloning PTs, uh, well, I don't want to mess up and... I'll just try this first. Ooh. Anything else gonna be aggro? Please don't, because I don't want to have to destroy this entire base. Alright. Let's just... Kinda try to break everything without breaking anything. There we go. Ooh, armor stone. I guess you can just craft those. You know, I should try to make a, uh, a BP for armor stones now that I think about it. Alright, let's go through the rest here. Alright, let's see what they got. Um, nothing really there, but we'll take it. Nothing really there. We'll take it all, though. Don't need fridges. Uh, we'll take the resources, the dino trackers, the foundations, the hides. Yeah, I mean, nothing exciting, but definitely we'll take it. Replicator. Alright, we'll take... All these shards. 
Um, we don't need the long neck ammo. Uh, we'll take the large metal walls, the jennies, all these resources. Resources are always nice, although we have so many now. Because we've done so many raids and gotten so many kit resources and everything. You know, we'll continue to take them just because, why not? It makes us never have to farm or at least stress about not having enough. Alright, but take all these. Take the dino trackers. Dino trackers are always nice. Repl or transmitters. Um, don't really need those tech suits. Fridge. Let's take the blood. The, uh, the eggs. And the eternal berries. That's pretty much all we need from there. Alright, well, that's the raid, I guess. Nothing too crazy. Didn't even get a single tame out of it, but we did get a lot of resources and a lot of shards, so I'm not complaining. With that raid finished, I continued scouting the air and the seas for any raid targets that I could find. Alright, well, I just found another base right on the corner, this time not in the ceiling, but on the ocean floor. So... Um... Kinda... Seems like an easy raid. There doesn't seem to be any turrets underneath, if I'm not mistaken, so I'm just gonna swim under. Um, I'll break this bubble from underneath. I really don't want to break the entire base again. I want the loot. I'm gonna try something. So the bubble's right there. If I hit right here... Yeah. That's what I was worried about. Alright, well, I don't want to... I don't want to break that <laughs> completely. I think what I'll do is I'll go to the other two things. Because I want the loot out of this. At the end of the day, it's more fun if I'm getting the loot out. I'll break these. And then we're just left with the final one. Not many turrets on it at all. So we'll just go behind in the back here. They're on the tech chest. And we're good. We are good. I'm gonna break this turret. Oh my gosh. Why do I, why am I getting charged at by Ephiomia? <laughs> Alright, let's break this wall. Probably was a better choice of a wall. <laughs> He's just chilling right there. You know, I might be able to do something like this. Oh, Ma, why? Why? Oh my gosh. Well, All that talk about trying to get the loot out, and, um, I go and do that. Alright, well, we'll go to the bottom, see if it's, the loot's down here, but... Uh, I doubt it. Yep, no loot. Everything despawned, unfortunately. I just found somebody's base, and I've been looking for this guy's base for a while, because he has... Where is it? Mine's right here, and he has a big turret boss trap there, and I guess maybe if I was a little smart, I'd just look straight above it, but he has a sky base right here. And my base is literally right there, so he is close by. He's very close. Oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> Let's not do that. I'll uh, we'll take off the gauntlets. And the shield. Alright, one, two, three, four, four generators, I think. 
it looks like. So we'll just do what we did to the other base and we'll just build up and then keep diving it until we get all the jennies. Come on, push through. Or can I open it? <laughs> Should I try to do that? Should I try to open it and get inside? That might be a play. That would be a really funny play, but if, I'm gonna try that. I'm gonna try that. I think uh, that might be a little easier to do than um, shooting through ORP. Well, I'm stuck inside this one, so. No. <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing. This is the more fun approach, <laughs> that's for sure. It's definitely not gonna be the most efficient, but if it does work, then that is awesome. I forgot to pop the thingies. I forgot to pop the thingies. That's open. That's definitely open right there. Alright, there's the goal. Right there. Drop in that hole. Alright, we got this. Start shooting. Open up. We're in. We're in. We're in. No way it worked. There's no way it worked. Alright, we're closing that. Oh. <laughs> there is no shot that just worked. Alright. Let's make our way to the Jennies. There's one right here. Can we open this? Should we open it? I guess what I kind of want to, so I don't break everything. We just go ahead. We break the generator. <laughs> Whatever. We're definitely damaging it. Is that an AFK pod? I think that's an AFK pod. Right there, so he doesn't get kicked. That's funny. Alright, next generator. Is there one over here? There's one on that corner. Oh, that's gonna be an issue. Although we might be able to just... Do this. There we go. And then... Gotta go this way. And get this generator. Alright, and then there should be one last Jenny all the way over here. <laughs> this is definitely, I think, the right approach. I gotta get rid of those turrets. Actually, I can get the Jenny just like this. Yeah, I think this was the right approach. Especially with the RP, it would have taken so long. Okay, there's one Jenny left in the middle. But this would have taken so long of just diving all these generators. So I'm glad that we chose the uh go inside <laughs> inside their uh their vacuum chambers. <laughs> this is definitely a lot more fun too. You know, never in my entire existence of Ark did I think that I was going to be, uh... Finding a sky base made out of vacuum chambers. And then, uh... <laughs> sneaking inside it to then blow five different generators. Like, what is this game, bro? Alright. Last Jenny, I think. And then we are good to start looting. You know, this base has to be pretty loaded. Um, I've seen this guy a lot yesterday when I was playing. And he has the big boss terminals and everything. So I'd imagine he's uh, he's got some, some loot. Hopefully our first big, big uh, cryo loot or something. Because we really haven't had many... Um, 
big halls for cryopods. It's just been a lot of resources and structures and stuff. And that is everything down. That is everything down. All right, he's right here. Let's see what he's got. All right, we already got a good tech suit. Uh, rep, celestial griffin armor, a good BP, good everything on him. This is awesome. Thank you. I'll basically take everything. Uh, even these. Yeah, you know what? Why not? Why not? You know what? Let's just we'll just take it all. We'll just we'll just take it all. And then we will go ahead. Kill him. This is definitely a uh, AFK chamber. So he doesn't get kicked. Um. Alright, what do we loot first? Uh. That's a lot of shards. I don't... Ooh, <laughs> scared me a bit. I don't want to break the things, so I want to make sure we can keep all the loot. So we're gonna... What I'll do is I'll go above the stuff to hit down onto them. But they didn't even break it in one shot. Wow. Okay. Wow. I mean, we basically want... Here, I'll drop what we don't want. How about that? That's probably easier than dropping what we do want. Or taking what we do want. And then we'll take everything else. And we're going to be black box, but let's go ahead. We'll TP home. And come straight back here. I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to use the uh, the rifle to break this stuff. Just so we don't risk losing anything. It's just... Why is there a chem bench just full of ARB and stuff? What? <laughs> Alright, what do we got? So many turrets. So many turrets. Alright. Um, BPs. Don't really need the BPs. We have our own, but we will take all of this. What are these? Ocean injectors. Yeah, I mean, basically want everything here. <laughs> this is all good loot, which is awesome. It is all good loot. Take that. Like, there's so many- there's just so many shards there, too. All these are empty, but that's alright. We got plenty of resources from all the other raids we've done. Yeah, I don't want to risk using the torch. It'd be a lot quicker if I used the torch, but... I don't want to risk it and then lose whatever loot's inside these. Alright, eternal workbench. Uh, we'll take these. We'll take the uh, Colossus medallions. All of this. The crystals. All of these. Celestial armor. There we go. Oh my gosh. Finally. Finally. We got celestial gloves. We've been waiting on that for so long. And we finally got them. Finally got Celestial Gauntlets, and okay, just a full thing of uh, resources and a PT. We'll take all of that. Blueprint Station. Um, I don't want all that chitin and keratin mix, but we'll take all the other resources that are in here. Primal Smithy. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, we're black boxed. Okay. Oh, shit. This is bad. Okay, we killed him off. I gotta go get his kit. I mean, he was just on a PT. But I am worried. Alright, his kit's bugged. Okay. I need to take this loot back, and I basically just need to dump it and come straight back. I don't want to risk losing any of this. I mean, he was on a PT, so we should be fine, but I am a little worried. Of course. Alright. Let's check this again. I mean, we basically want everything out of here, so we're just going to take it all. That has so much HP. How much damage do we do per shot? Yeah, that's not happening. Alright. Let's, uh... Structure damage on top of the rep. Get on top of the soul terminal. 
I should have taken away my my tower. I think he followed my tower up and found me. All right, what do we got? Oh, it's all fertilizer. I thought these were all souls. Okay, that we do have some though. Some uh, some beetles, princess peaches, X B L. That's amazing. Firecracker Velo, Firecracker Velo, and a Strikeosaurus. Let's check this replicator. It's full of stuff as well. Um, I'm pretty much we're pretty much in the clear. He didn't have many cryos, which is honestly kind of disappointing. Um, I figured he would, but uh, that's all right. We'll take all the amazing gear that we got from him, because to be honest, he had a lot of cool gear. But um, you yeah, know, take all this. Don't need that. It's not that great of an egg. The resources is great. Don't need the flag BPs. Take the crystals. All these resources. Gunpowder will take it. What do we got in here? Fridge, just a bunch of kibble. Alright. Alright, we'll take all these resources. Thank you very much. Two hundred and twenty-nine slots of shards. And we're capped. Alright, let's take all this back. Hi. <laughs> what? My guy just pulled up and rocketed me. I want his kit. I want to see what he has. What? I guess he just grabbed his kit. Alright. Why do you have so much ammo, bro? Oh my god. Alright. Back to base. So let's uh, hop in here. I guess we're not hopping in there. But uh, yeah, very successful raid. Just honestly, I expected a little bit more on the side of Thames than what we got. But to be honest, we got four to five caps of loot out of that. So I can't complain. After raiding those three bases, I felt good. But I still had a thirst for blood. So I continued scouting Ragnarok. So I just found another base right in the corner of the map. Um, yeah, we're gonna hit it. Why not? What's going on? Let me cryo. All right, it's just a little water base. Nothing too crazy, but uh, I figured why not. Um, just place this here. Underwater raid. All right, let's see what the best way to do this is. Honestly, there's not that many turrets, so we can probably, I mean, can we just swim underneath there? I can literally probably just swim underneath. I'm just going to do that. Swim underneath. And go from there. Uh, this is bad. Okay, we're in a good spot. Is the generator in here? It is. Okay. Um. I, I've t I was like, how do we blow this up? And I, I remembered I have a torch that literally does that for me. And everything is down. That was almost too easy. Almost too easy. Although I am almost dead, to be completely fair. Alright, let's just... Oh, that's a moon pool. I can just walk in there. I don't need to do that. Alright. Well, this honestly kind of looks like a little bit of a... A juicy base. Uh, let's see. Anything on him? Nope. Alright, let's... Uh, well, I don't really want to flood this. 
So I guess I'll just use the rifle to break stuff. Uh, anything in the primal smithy? Nothing we really need. Uh, transmitter, just take the Ellie. Uh, nothing there. Take the eggs. Don't need anything. It has all these deadies. So nicely lined up. And there's just nothing in this base. It's so sad. Alright. Anything in the fridge? Not really. Alpha meat. One alpha meat. <laughs> um, Should be fine. And then I can flood this. Check the vault. Was not worth it. Although I will take the fabby and the ammo. The ammo is pretty nice. I don't have to craft it then. But uh. Alright. Yeah I'm not going to break all the resources. I don't really need them to be honest. <laughs> we have like 200 million of each. So uh. Yeah, successful raid, I guess, but um, nothing, nothing crazy. They are in there. Um, kind of want to try to kill that stego. All right, we're gonna try to get inside that. Can I find a safe spot, please? Okay. So the Jenny is definitely in this thing, right? So he's right there. Where's the generator? The generator inside the replicator? Is that what I'm seeing? I think it is. I think the generator is inside the rep. <laughs> Let's just break the rep. Just to confirm. Yeah, it's right there, okay. That leaves me in a bit of a predicament because I need to get inside that box somehow. And I have no idea how I'm gonna do that. Especially because I got a stego being a really annoying. Come on. Come here. You're gonna get me killed. Alright, stego's dead. There we go. Good start. Oh, too much lag. He's still in there? He's still there. Alright, that's gonna be an issue. He's literally just spamming turrets in there. <laughs> okay. 
Okay. Well, we cleared the two turrets off the top of that. Now, I don't really have a plan. <laughs> There's not a way in, right? There's not like a sneaky back entrance or something. Okay, well, I mean, there's some damage. Let's just send rockets out. It's coming outside. That's not good. Saw a celestial something jump out of here. He just jumped with his celestial ferox into my fob. Oh my gosh. You know he's mad. You already know he's mad. Alright, well we broke the front door. I'm just going to try to splash for the door there. Door's open. <laughs> He's just watching damage happen. I don't know why he doesn't come and try to like beat me or like punch me out or anything. He's just sitting there. Like he obviously has tames too. Because he ran out with a celestial ferox. Like that's not a beginner tame. Is he de he's despawning? He's literally popcorning. What? Oh my gosh. That is hilarious. I'm not even in the base. I've rocketed a couple times. And he's despawning. What? I'm actually kind of surprised. Like, why would you despawn? I've barely done anything. I don't even think I can get in either. Like, I'll probably eventually get in, but like, what's the point? I can't believe he's actually despawning. That is hilarious. He just tossed a mana. He's just despawning all his stuff. <laughs> this is so stupid. You know, it's almost a little annoying because I give him the benefit of an online. I wanted to be nice, giving him an online and stuff. And instead of like defending with the Celestial Feroxes like he very easily could, he's just despawning them. And popcorning all his loot. Like, why? Whatever. Whatever. Just gonna wipe him now. Alright, I think that's all the Ferox is dead. Put this away. And TP back to the last remote location. What did he just... He's breaking stuff now. What is he doing? <laughs> no way, bro. 
He's breaking the, the things now, so I don't even see the things. Oh, he picked up all the eggs. He's probably going to drop them in the bag. Let's see it. Oh, nope, he's demoing the things. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. This is hilarious. <laughs> He's popcorning again. He's still popcorning. Look at him go. Look at him go. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> this is hilarious. This is hilarious. He can't he can't go fast enough, man. He's got to keep popcorning. <laughs> Alright, let's see. Can I maybe see four down? Alright, well, we opened a wall. Do I try to run in there? I think I have to. I'll wait till my, my brews are up. He doesn't even notice that the wall is gone. No, that's really bad. He's definitely getting my kit there. There's no way he does not get my kit. Unless he's so tunnel visioned on popcorning, but I literally died in front of him. Yeah, he got my kit. All down. Dickhead. Oh, I gotta check those bags. That's probably my kit. I don't give a shit about that. He definitely just dropped my entire kit on the floor. Yeah, he did right there. Oh, what a dick. My torch! That's all I care about is the torch. <laughs> Wow, I'm I'm shocked. I'm shocked. You know, there's um I'd expect this on some other servers, but on a server like this where it's you know, it's it's kind of chill, you know, there's not really a a toxicity aspect of it for the most part. It's kind of just like a vibe. You know, that was kind of a shock for someone to despawn and there's someone pushing the fob. Or trying to push the fob, or... I'm not really sure. What is what is going on here? I got my fun out of raiding him. He's a little salty that he got raided. But, uh... It is what it is. Now I'm just gonna clear out the entire base so he has no chance at ever rebuilding. Because he wanted to be toxic, so I will be toxic. And then, uh... We'll move on. And you just keep moving.
Alright, and I'm pretty sure that is everything, uh, destroyed. Um, we got nothing out of this raid except, uh, a lot of laughs because he despawned everything. So, um, let's kill these, uh, few manas that are flying around here and then we'll go find something else to do. With that really weird raid finished, and the guy popcorning all of his loot before I even started properly raiding, I was ready to head to sleep for the night, but before I did, I wanted to beef up the base. Alright, and that is pretty much everything I am going to do to the base. You know, we had some people show up while I was adding some additions. So I figured, why not uh, do a little bit of upgrades. So I added another row of turrets, another like full row of turrets, another layer of turrets right there. And then of course a full net below. And then a hatch frame net and then a door frame net to stop people diving it so hopefully that stops us from getting raided you know it might not but um i don't really want to do much more than this because uh there's already 828 turrets placed so i don't really know how because it does not look like i placed that many turrets but i'm sure i did and we have plenty of ammo for all those turrets so if we get raided now i'm gonna be shocked but I'm happy with the way this looks. And with the base looking better than it ever has before, I felt comfortable enough to head to sleep. But boy, was I wrong. While I was sleeping, someone showed up and soaked all 800 turrets and completely wiped me. But this series doesn't end here. Nah. I wanted my revenge and I would stop at nothing to get it. But that's a story for another day. We're back on Primal Fear and today is all about revenge. The last episode ended with us getting offline raided. So today, my main goal was to rebuild and get my revenge. And we're back. And yes, unfortunately, we were raided. Um, yeah, I got off and uh, while I was sleeping for the night, I got wiped. And they were kind of toxic about it too. They were shit talking me in the discord. <laughs> Uh, as they were soaking me, and obviously I was sleeping, so I didn't see it. But, um, it's time for a little bit of um, a revenge arc, shall we say. Getting back to raiding everybody. You know, we did a lot of raiding in the last two parts. But now, we're looking for revenge. To show everybody that we're back and raid as many people as we can. And just hopefully find the dodo on top people and raid them as well. I don't know if they're still in the server. Um, we'll find out soon enough. But for now, we need to work on getting back everything that we lost. We'll buy this starter kit. We'll get the uh, gear on. And I think instead of building in the corner, because yes, the corner was a very OP spot and... A lot of people weren't able to raid it. It was too difficult to raid. And they ended up just soaking me from what I've been told. So if I can just find a new spot that's very similar to that. But obviously not in the corner. So maybe a little more hidden. I think I might just go into the center of the map. And um, do the same exact thing. And I think honestly we're going to build straight up above this. It's not... In a corner it's not against a wall 
and it should be high enough off the ground that you don't render it from the ground. That was going to build over in the middle of the map because I felt like that might be safer, but the the ground is a little too high and I'm a little worried that you might render it from the bottom. So we're just going to build straight up from here and hopefully no one finds the base long enough for us to get our revenge. Or if they do, it's too hard for them to raid. All right, so we're just going to do a four by four, I think. I think that should be plenty of room. And then we can just do this. All right, that should be good now. Let's get the TP down right in the middle. And I'll name this to the base. And then let's get the this guy down next to it. Store our cryos there and then get the rep down right in the corner beautiful now we just need to get turrets everywhere so uh let's start getting all the different smithies and everything that we need crafted and then we'll be good to go to start building this base even stronger and i guess i'll see you guys once everything is finished All right, so this is what we've got so far. Definitely uh, needs a lot more turret coverage everywhere, but this is a good starter. I'm gonna go ahead, make a bunch of uh, ammo, and then I do a couple raids and then come back and do some more upgrades, do another ring probably all the way around full of turrets. But this for now is secure. They can't go above, they can't go below, and we should be good to go to start progressing, start getting tames going and start uh, rating with the base built in a very hidden spot i headed out and started taming yo 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 chill with that i want to be able to see oh i, I have an oh it's right here okay that makes things easy let's just bring it down to here i guess yeah, it's still falling and um cryo this guy up get out the bow hey chill How did that miss? There we go. Just need one of these to land. <laughs> There we go. All right, now we need to go back to base, get Apex Kibble. And I landed literally inside it, okay. Griffin, Kibble in, Tame Helper in. Tamed up, beautiful. And we got ourselves a level 779 Apex Griffin, just like that. All right, let's level this guy up a bit. Um. Just go speed. Uh, please don't kill me. <laughs> We've got 300 movement speed. Um, go up to 20k stam. We'll put this into melee for now. Alright, let's level this guy up. And we'll have to get him a saddle. And then we can work on getting... All the best kibbles in the game. Or, not kibbles, but narcotic in the game get work on origin narcotics and stuff and then we can work on I'll just go like a million hp or 1.2 and then the rest in the melee all right we're almost there it's taken a little bit of time to kill this because it's not really cooperating that well but should be like one more hit it's running. Maybe I don't really know what's going on. Okay, well, we'll just finish it off like this. It's whatever. Let's make sure we get the blood from it. Most important part. Yep, beautiful. And we are good. Nice. So let's go ahead and take this home. 
and start working on getting ourselves origin narcotic and origin uh trank arrows After getting some tames tamed, it was time to start farming bosses for some gear. Alright, there we go. We got ourselves the Demonic Emperor's Soul and the Celestial Emperor's Soul. So now we can move on to the next set of bosses. Alright, let's give this a go. We got Pickin and Nova to spawn in now. And then we're pretty much good to just keep steamrolling through the bosses. We've got this guy ready to go. Get the saddles on him. And, or her, I should say. Power up. And we'll start with Nova. Nova's definitely the easier of the two. So we'll just give it a quick C spin. And then one of these maybe. I know there's supposed to be a lot of damage dealt from this. Let's just hope I don't die first. Definitely getting bullied right now, oh, man. Okay. There we go. Defeated. Let's make sure we get our egg. And that was a little harder than I thought because I didn't turn the turrets on, but for picking, we definitely want the turrets off because he's just going to soak through our stuff. But we got ourselves Nova the Destroyer egg. Beautiful. And we'll go ahead... We'll take whatever we want out of here. Honestly, nothing. It's she is invincible, but it's working. Let's let's go through the invincibility. We got this. She's invincible, but we'll f let's fight through. We'll fight through. <laughs> we fought through. <laughs> she was invincible, so the other guy would have worked. But she was just healing constantly, which means she's invincible, and <laughs> still managed to kill her. That is awesome. That is awesome. Alright, well now we can move on to the next bosses. So that is... <laughs> That's beautiful. That should have been a lot easier than it was there, but... We still managed to get it done. So now it is time for the Titans. Now... If it goes the same way as it did last time, we should be fine. Because um, this thing is a beast. 
but uh, obviously it can always go wrong. So, start with electric. And uh, hope for the best here. <laughs> yeah, there we go. As expected. It's doing a ton of damage. There we go. go and we got dismounted again we never got dismounted before so that's just wild must got really lucky all right and that is all the colossus Colossus? yeah colossus done and now it is time for the picking the picking's revenge as ready as we're gonna be so three two one. Hello, buddy. And you're spawning right on top of me. How nice of you. Just remember, we gotta watch our stem for this fight. We're good. There we go. Now that's him defeated. It doesn't seem that hard, but I mean, without this, without Nova, that would have been an extremely difficult base. And they've t they've spawned another one of my me in. A little strange. And we got the torch. So I couldn't be happier. Now that I was back to the point where we left off last time, it was time to start raiding again. Alright, well I just found this little stone hut, um, obviously not the, uh, most intense raid ever, but, uh, it's gonna be our first raid back, back in, uh, set up, so, might as well get a little warm up in, and I need a spot to place this TP. I don't think I'll die, but just in case, I'll just name it, raid. All right, and I think we have everything we need. Just gonna run up and tech rifle in. Um, all the right armor on. Yeah, we're good. Just send it. Some of the turrets are off for some reason. Can I get in? I see the Jenny. I'm just gonna go the other side. What is going, did I, I didn't break it, okay. Oh, hey, 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 whoa, 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 chill, chill. There we go. And now it's all down. <laughs> it's a lot stress, more stressful than it should have been. Let's just break this. Anything in the soul terminal? No. Nope. Anything in here? Honestly, it's a kit resource. I'm gonna take it because I am running out of a lot of things. So I will gladly take that. I'm just gonna send a rocket right down. Down in the middle of the base. Why not? Yep, there we go. And we'll take all the ammo. Because why not? Alright, let's see what's going on in here. Okay. Um. Don't know if they know that there's another entrance. <laughs> uh. Alright. Well, I'm just gonna try to. Can I just grapple. Well, I don't think you can grapple glitch. Now I'm gonna put the tech chest on and just try to get up to the, the thing up there, I guess. Are these all heavies? 
He's online. Um, please. I don't know what to do here. Uh, I mean, he is online. This hurts. Like, this actually hurts. I've got so much HP, too. I can't do anything to that right now. Actually, what I can do, since it's poking its head into me. I want you to knock out. Where's this generator? It's right there. Is that all down? It's, no, it's not all down. That's down, though. I got one of the jennies. Gotta watch my HP here. Come on, I try to open the torch! Come on, let me knock you out. Let me knock you out, please. Alright, what is it doing? What is it doing? You know what? I'm, I'm just gonna leave you there. Oh, no, you're coming back. Okay. I'm just gonna jump down here, actually, and try to deal with it over here. And I just run up and tap it. There we go. Alright, good, good, good. Alright, let's kill this before we move on. Alright. Let's try to find this generator. Any beds? I don't see any beds. I imagine the Jenny's probably behind that or something. I'm just gonna slowly make my way. Oh no. Messed up. Let's destroy as many of these as I can. We're good, we're good. I still don't see the generator. Although we should be able to just take these out. And then hop behind there because it looks like the full wall is covered. For whatever reason. <laughs> I'm not really too sure, but I'd imagine the Jenny's back there. So we slowly sneak our way up here maybe. It. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. I think it's down in that corner. Oh, I see it. It's in front of the wall. Shit. I wonder if that's the only generator. I'm gonna just have to go for it. Yeah, that's... Uh, I don't think I'm gonna be able to touch that wall. Not with him being online and being... A little risky so I'm just gonna loot and loot and dip. Shit. What is in there? Okay well that's gonna be a problem. It's gonna be a big problem because someone else is taking my raid. Did that just go through the ceiling? And completely just... Okay. Well, now I'm kind of stuck in here. I don't really have anything I can do to a Bacon Griffin, so I'm just going to try to get the loot and leave. Of course, he goes in the second... The second I hop off that, he goes in.
just gonna keep bombing and then... Looting and then going back to bombing. Alright, there's a lot of resources in here. He just died. I think he just died. Let's get all this element out. Alright, well that was a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot of resources. So that is beautiful. We shouldn't have to worry about resources really ever again. Um, there's still a lot there, but uh, yeah, I mean there wasn't much there in terms of anything else other than resources, but um, the resources alone make that raid worth it. Alright, well I just found something very interesting. Um, there's a lot of turrets here from Dodo on top, and if you remember from the beginning of the episode, these were the guys that raided me. They might even still be in logs. Now, a little too late, but these were the guys who raided me, and, uh, by the looks of it, they were living in Highlands Cave, or at least moved into Highlands Cave. And they're wet. They're wiped. So our uh, our revenge arc isn't gonna happen, unfortunately. But that being said, it does not mean I'm stopping. There's plenty of people I want to raid, and uh, I'm gonna make sure it happens. But the revenge raid isn't gonna be one of those raids, unfortunately. After scouting around for a bit, I decided to take a break from raiding and tame a little. All right, I'm gonna tame up this prime penguin because why not? I thought about taming a penguin. Well, actually I was, I saw that guy's penguino and I was like, you know what, I should tame a penguin. I don't know how to get a penguino, um, but this is pretty close. <laughs> not really, but you know, close enough. Um, I need to do a lot of little research because what they were using was honestly really cool. They were using bacon um, Bigfoots and they were able to basically soak the entire base and yeah they had like 2 billion hp so i'm gonna i need what do i need eternal meat or something like that i'm gonna go after we tame this penguin and try to figure out how to do that uh how to get those bacon bigfoots i think they'd be pretty cool to get make raiding a little easier but uh we definitely need to up our tame game right now because it's 
kind of lacking. There we go. All right, we got a Karaku, so I'm gonna bring that back to base. I need to figure out how to get a Penguino, because they're a lot better than these, but yeah, I'm gonna try to figure out how to get some other tames and keep an eye on the dino scans on the transmitter to see if anything worth taming pops up. All right, that's enough taming. Back to raiding. All right, well, I was just going through to go tame some stuff, or get some primal blood, or I'm blood. Yeah, there we go. And I saw this bubble, so I am gonna go and raid this. Cause why not? Uh, the best way to do this, cause I have to hit it, and then I'm gonna get shot immediately. Let's just pop shit everything. And we'll try to hit this bubble. Eventually, we'll get it. <laughs> Come on! Come on! I don't want to have to shoot it. I mean, we can just shoot it. It'll be better. Anyway. They're probably not super rich. But, uh... We can at least get a couple dinos. I'd be happy. Even just to get resource. The more resources, the better. Although, we are kind of loaded on resources right now. Oh, he is online. Hello. Um, my guy says that's not going to work. When it's literally about to work. Alright, I'm gonna have to go. And just immediately, like, run away. Oh no. Is there no ammo in that at all? Like, what's going on? <laughs> he goes, it's a you. There's no ammo. There is no ammo in his turrets. Whee! There's ammo in those turrets. I just wanna... I just want to check the loot, man. I don't want to wipe you completely. That's just rude. I'm cheating now. Oh my god. <laughs> That's funny. That is a funny one. Alright, that should be everything gone. I'm not gonna blow everything up, even though they did call me a cheater for no reason. At all. <laughs> uh, let's see if there's anything else I want out of here. Um, I'll take the berries. Narcotic and stuff, why not? Crystal, spark.
Yeah, I don't really need anything else. Alright, well I just found a base in this corner. Be a pretty easy raid, I think. Um, and it looks like they got a few tames. I think what we'd do is just hop up on the top up there. And then go from there. So I'm going to try to get TP down. Alright, so we got our vacuum chambers up here for our little mini fob. Just going to name this fob. And then put our beds up. Perfect. And uh, let me zoom into this so I know exactly what I'm dealing with. Yeah, I guess honestly best case is just go above. Drop down in. Yeah, I'm just going to go with that. Let's hope this works. Oh no, I'm... I'm dead. Okay. <laughs> I was where I wanted to be, but uh... It didn't really work out very well. Alright, well I survived long enough that time to uh, at least <laughs> actually see where I was before I died. But um, we're definitely making damage. I think we'll pop one of these vacuum compartments open sooner or later. I'm just going to keep trying to land on the same one if I can. Yeah, I just popped it open. I think I'm inside. I am inside. Alright, perfect. Uh, there's an internal right there. So I don't know how I'm not getting shot, but I'm not getting shot. I'm going to look for the Jenny here. Uh, where is it? <laughs> well, I guess I'm just going to... Inside this? Maybe? I don't know. Behind the griffin? No? Guess I'll just go for the turret. Alright. Still don't see the generator. right there okay well, I'm pretty sure I can just open their stuff up you know do is I'll actually just leave it because there's nothing inside so oh they have so much ammo too that's beautiful I'm gonna break all the beds actually he's sleeping right here what does he got? Electric Griffin? We'll take it. We will gladly take an Electric Griffin. Uh, the weapons. Gladly take the weapons. Thank you very much. The server keeps freezing. Right, I think that's all the beds. Nope, there's a pod right here. Alright, uh, yeah, I don't really want to, there's a tech gen up here too, I'll get that. I open this. Okay, can just break this one. Everything's still on. Um, yeah, I'm just going to tech rifle. Uh, I, I think I have to tech rifle everything if I don't want it to lose it all. So, shards will gladly take. Feathers. 
uh, all of this, all the resources, because why not? Whatever. Let's loot everything else and then we'll get that. Alright, we'll take all the potions. This, that. There we go. Seeds table. Um, we'll take some vegetable seeds, actually. We don't have any. Um, which ones didn't we grab? Sad root. Okay. No. That's what I was worried about. So we just lost whatever was in there. Um, Alright, I'm just gonna break this, I think. Up on top of it and break it. Alright, everything's down. That's the, the sad thing about sky bases, though, is... You can't really break certain things, and you end up just losing it. Alright, we'll take everything out of that, though. Ooh, okay, a bunch of eggs, fabled PT eggs, wyvern eggs. I'm glad they take that. We'll take all of these different types of eggs. Who are those? Alpha dodo egg, apex RG egg, gladly take that. Honestly, we'll just take everything out of this. Beautiful. Bunch more ammo. More black box. to go home real quick. I'm gonna try to go from, like, the side maybe and I can hit it. Did it actually just stay there? Oh my gosh. Okay, well, we did all that for nothing. <laughs> but, it's fine. It's fine. Let's see. Can we access the bag? Definitely worth the the uh, the effort though, because we got Anki, uh, the Strikosaurus or whatever that's called, some Raptors, a bunch of PTs, a Fire Griffin, a Dodic, and some Mantis. Beautiful. All right, what's in here? We already checked that. We already checked those. Uh, let's break this transmitter. Doesn't look like there was anything in the transmitter. Um, let's grab the rest of the ammo out of here. Well, we got what we needed. We got what we came for. It was a good raid. So I'm going to clean up. And then... Uh, actually, what's in these bags? Egg and poop. Um, I'll take all the eggs. Burt maker. Take that. Gardener. Uh, we'll take the crops. And the crystals. Alright. Well, let's go. Alright, well, um... I just flew into this base, but I just found a base. Is he... I think he's online? Kind of? <laughs> um... <laughs> Okay. I mean, he's not actually online. But he is bouncing back and forth on the thing. It looks like he has a lot of different jennies. Okay. I think maybe best way to do this, because the jennies are vault dropped there, is to maybe get on top and then open one and go in. We've, we've done that before and it worked. So I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to get... Get some vacuums up and try to get to work here. I guess just go for it. I don't really know where I'm at right now. Okay, I'm down below. Yeah, this is going to be interesting because there are so many turrets that I don't think I'm ever going to actually see where I'm at. It's just going to be too laggy. So, we'll just keep trying until it works, I guess. Well, I'm still on top of that.
Come on. No, I had it. Go in, go in. Alright, I'm in. I'm in. <laughs> and he's just sitting there bouncing back and forth on his jump pads. Alright. Yeah, I think the best thing we can do is just break all the uh, the things from underneath because there's Jennies on the outside, so it's not going to, I'm not going to be able to take out the Jennies. So if I can just break everything from below and steal it just like that, I'm happy. There we go. So many turrets. Jeez. Okay. Now I gotta be careful not to uh, get myself in a bad position here, but. Replicator. Just a bunch of stuff. No tames yet, though. Um, is there a place for tames? There's a god shrine over there. There's the griffin. I'm just going to open up all these portholes. I'll break the generator. Yeah, like I thought, nothing broke. Yeah, I mean, there's, there's him. And then there's the three beds and the griffin. Did we get... Okay, that's my bag. There's no more bags. Alright, well, I guess I'll just kill him. He should fall right in front of me, yep. And he has a bait. There we go. That That is ginormous. I could not be happier with that. Getting the bacon overlord, Griffin. I'm actually going to go straight home. Not risk this anymore. Because I can go home, take this home, I can clone it. Oh, that's that's what we needed. That is what we needed. I've been trying to get that, saving up points for it and everything. That is huge. I'm going to clone that immediately, actually, before I do anything else. That's exactly what we were looking for with raiding. I'm not going to lie. That's what I've been looking for this entire time. This is beautiful. Just beautiful. All right. Clone. And it's an insta clone. And I'm just going to make like 10 of them. Just keep cloning them. This is beautiful. It is so beautiful. All right. There we go. Uh, that made that raid alert worth it. Even though he didn't have any other cryos, the fact that he had one cryoed on him. Just makes everything worth it. Let's just put all of this away. Um, I'm going to use the one he actually had. Alright, yeah, there is no way I'm getting that. Or any of these, to be honest. So, I've got everything I need. We may not have completely wiped the base, but we got what we need. We got what we came for. We got all the loot. And uh, now we're getting out. With those raids finished, things were looking good. My raiding spree had begun, and I didn't plan on stopping anytime soon. But the rest of this story is for another day. So, until next time. Today was going to be my final day on this season of Primal Fear, and I had one goal, raid everyone. With that goal in mind, our day today starts in the sky. Okay, so I just found another base, and uh... Yeah, we're just gonna try to raid it as well. Um, it's a pretty thick base along the edge here so we're gonna set up a little spot and uh get to work uh let's see what's the best way to do this honestly probably going up top and then popping down in is there a jenny down there or is there only one jenny there's only one generator yeah let's just pop on top Hopefully it's not too laggy. We'll make this work.
Well, I was gonna say it's not too laggy, because it looked like we were doing fine, and then we got launched the other side of the base, so, uh... Definitely a little laggy. Well, I was on top of the base, <laughs> but it never showed me there. Come on. Come on. No, I froze it! I can't get the option! Can I shoot my gun at least? No, oh, I... Alright, well, I was there, but I was getting bounced around too much by the tech turret. Alright, well, we can keep trying that. It'll work eventually. Maybe I should try to use this. This could be a big mistake. I feel like it could be fun. Well, that um worked surprisingly well. Uh, okay. That worked a lot better than I thought it was going to. Uh, let's grab the Jenny. Real quick. Oh, I kind of want to get this, the rep, let's get the replicator first. Just in case. Alright, there we go. Get the generator. This guy. Alright. 500k Ellie in the Jenny. Kit resource in there. And a bunch of resources and some ammo in here. And is that it? Actually? I thought there would be a lot more in here. Because this was kind of decently built. It's named Home. I'm sorry, man. I'm not going to destroy it. So, I'm going to be nice. Even though people usually aren't nice to me. Usually when I get back from being raided, my entire base is cored out. Uh, but yeah, he didn't even have much ammo. I'm actually kind of surprised. Like, I'm kind of shocked that it was pretty empty. But we'll take this these resources home, and uh, then we'll get back to scouting. Hold up, hold up, hold up. We just passed the base. It has no turrets in it, though. Oh, it's Doom. This guy was kind of nice to me earlier. I don't really want to raid him. <laughs> Not gonna lie. I'm conflicted here. You know what? This is my good deed for the day. I'm gonna look at you guys when I say this. I do a lot of mean things on this Primal Fear server. You know, I've raided a lot of bases that I probably should have just left there. But, this will be my good deed for the day. I will leave this base here. And not raid it. With our fun in the sky over for now, it was time for the ocean. I don't even know what I'm fighting. What is this? Ah! You not doing damage to me? I don't even know. I know I'm doing damage to it. I'm gonna kill it. I don't know what I'm doing, but I'm gonna kill it. It's- I killed, like, a Moza, and it spawned. It's almost dead. I can't see anything, but... It's almost dead. I'm just gonna melee it. Oh, it just gained a hundred million HP. Why did you gain so much HP? 
What? <laughs> Alright, I'm just gonna constantly melee it to death here. Tameable Kraken just spawned. Okay. Do I have arrows on me? I do. Well, I guess I'm taming the Kraken. I don't even know what just happened. I killed some random Moza that was kind of in my way while I was scouting for base locations. And, uh, this guy came out of nowhere. Or, I guess the other... The boss came out of nowhere. Speaking of which, does he have anything in his thing? Oi! Okay, firecracker summoner. Can I, can I take it? Yep. Uh, potion thingy. You know, god shrine and a lot, a lot, a lot of these guys. If I put this on, can I see better underwater? No. Okay. Well, I'll take all those. I don't really need anything else from there, so let's go put that in there. And it is tamed up. Any special attacks? Interesting. Uh, should we just go to a billion HP? That seems fun. We'll go 500 million. Oh my god, it can come out of the water. It can just chill on land. Okay. A red kraken. What? Oh my god! Did you accidentally drop this? Who are you? Well, hopefully he has fun. I figured that's that's the uh, at least what I owe him for scaring the absolute shit out of him. All right, I'm gonna head home and get rekitted, and then we'll go do that raid. I feel like that's 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 another good deed for the day.
After messing around with that bob, I headed out to do some more raiding. Uh, I have no idea what I'm looking at, but... There's a bunch of turrets here. And a cloner. And I'd imagine, yep, the Jenny's right there, so I'm just gonna run straight for that Jenny. I have a... thingy down. Hopefully. Well, that didn't work. That didn't go strictly to plan, unfortunately. Uh, so we're just going to respawn and go straight back over. Um, there's a vault on top of it now, unfortunately. So hopefully I can hit it through the vault. If I can't, if there is, that'd be awesome. If there's not, then it's whatever. But that is everything down. Let's break all the beds. And then break the structures and please have loot. That's the generator bag. And no loot. Of course, no loot. I guess they were probably just using this as a boss summoning spot or like a place to clone. What's what's this name? Nothing. It's not even named. Uh, let's see. Any shards in the cloner, maybe? Yeah. All right. Not even that many shards. Okay. Yeah, there's not much ammo either. All right, well kind of hoping for at least something some goody but i guess not okay i just flew into this thing um i'm not really sure what it is but it almost killed my griffin so i think i might just go raid it yeah it's just this cave someone's built a little contraption at the front of it so i'm just gonna go to the front of it Run in, get the Jenny. And I... Why are there turrets on the outside, too? Alright, well, I think maybe the best bet is to go from the inside. The Jenny's, what, right over there? It's not beyond this one, but it's beyond the next one. Yep, that's all down. Any loot? Yeah, three charcoal. Woot woot. Very nice loot. Yeah. They knew how to do a kit turret, but they couldn't do a kit resource. For whatever reason. Alright, so I wasn't gonna raid this guy, but he is shit-talking so much in chat. And I'm just going to speed wipe his base. Just literally gonna go above it. Drop down on the top. And wipe it. Just because he's shit-talking in chat. Okay. Alright, well his entire base is down. Okay. I don't even feel bad. Like, I kind of do, because he's a Bob. But, like, for how much he was shit-talking, he kind of deserves it. Like, I'm not even going to take anything from this. There's no point. I don't even know if this is the base he's on about, but... Hey! Give me that back. Can't just go around stealing people's stuff. 
After a few raids on Ragnarok, I headed over to Lost Island. Okay, well, um, I was just flying literally at the speed of light and face planted into their shield. So there's a base here, and they have so many tames. There's a dragon, there's literally everything. There's just dragons everywhere. Goliath? Karkinos? Well, I guess I'm just gonna try to make my way in here. I don't know if they're online. It might be. Shield should break. Right then. Let's just back up a bit. Oh my gosh. I think it's mostly heavies. I don't know why I'm... When I shield, I take damage. Interesting. Well, I'm definitely not going to be shielding. There's the generator, just like I thought. Server's lagging. Um, did it turn the turrets off? It did not. So, we are going to be exploring the castle grounds. Although, I think literally everything is just heavies. So, I should be able to just... Yeah. I can just run wherever I want. See, I feel bad for this, because they've really built this, like, castle up. But they just didn't place any other turrets other than heavies. And I don't know why. It's kind of funny just being able to tank a turret. And no care in the world just being able to take every shot. Okay, well that that hurts. Well, it doesn't hurt that bad, but it's it's enough to be a problem. All right, there's another generator. Any turrets going down? Nope. <laughs> Oh, okay. It's not even like, it, well, it definitely doesn't hurt, but it's just so loud every time I start getting beamed. Is that all down? Oh, this is down. I think that is everything down. All right. Let's just knock these out. No need to kill him. Structure damage mode. Nothing there. I don't know if they have like a crafting station or something. Or they just have the replicators. There's just some shards and stuff, but they don't even have tech turrets. They definitely have to have something. Like some type of storage spot. Ooh. Bunch of Karki eggs and Goliath clone eggs. Okay. I'm actually kind of excited about that. I kind of want to try these. Goliaths. They seem pretty. Per per wait, what? English? Pretty cool. I mean, it was a cool raid and they had nothing but heavies, so it made it easy, but. Yeah, I'm con kind of confused. Okay, I just flew into something. I don't even know what I just flew into, but... Something. <laughs> there's a lot of turrets back there. It almost killed the griffin. I'm pretty sure there's just a big base in the back there. Um... Am I good back here? Let me shoot, if I can get these two turrets. Am I good? Um, can I turn my brightness up? Yeah, there we go. Well, I got extremely lucky. I keep getting extremely lucky. Because... There was rocks here from... 
just, you know, breakable rocks and they didn't they didn't think to break them and put turrets here, so now I'm inside. And we're in. Alright. Well, let's uh let's get to looting, I guess. Alright, what do you got? You don't really have much on you. Take some of it though. I will give him, it's a pretty uh, hidden spot. I only checked it because I've been checking all the caves because I figure someone is just hiding in some stupid spots that just normally wouldn't get built, but you know, you hide here and you hope for the best. Uh, replicator. Um, I will take these. Don't really need all of this, but I'll take the resources. Uh, some of the resources, I guess. I'll take this. I need to place that. Uh, I'll take the PT. I'll take that Magmasaur egg. I'll take them both. Why not? Well, I will... Uh, no, you know what? I've left enough people their bases. This one's going. This one's going. I've been too nice today. This one is... Crumbling. <laughs> Everything must fall. Alright. I'm happy with that now. <laughs> we got a couple... Or we got one PT and we got some cryos and a decent, or not cryos, but uh, eggs and a decent amount of resources. I'm happy with that. Alright, well there's a base in this little rat hole thing. Let me do my little box and we're on for another raid. Oh, well, I'm just going to run in. I think that's the best strategy to get information. No, no. Alright. Oh, no, 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 no. Alright. There's not many turrets. So we should be fine to just go back in. Uh. Let me in the door. Ah, there's even more turrets. Ah! Um, run back out, run back out. Nope, okay. Alright, it wasn't that bad of a strategy. Let's do it again. Okay. Well, we cleared out the first wall. The second wall is a little bigger, it looks like. Pop these. We might just have to keep going and going and going until we get everything down. A little bit of damage there. That was a decent rocket. I don't know if we got much on that little wall thingy, but definitely got a lot of foundations. Alright, well that was a lot of rockets. I don't know how much damage we did to turrets, but we definitely got some structures. Okay. We can just turn the corner and kind of slowly rocket our way in.
But yeah, that is a big wall. I'm going to try to... Alright. You're a generator. Where is this generator that I hear? Okay. <laughs> Progress. It's like sneak my way up there. Wait for the wreckage to go away. I'm just swinging. I see a shield generator. Just break and let me pass. Okay, I'm not gonna lie. I cannot believe that just works. I literally, I thought to myself, I didn't say anything out loud. I was just like, all right, it's gonna take a long time if I don't get this and this doesn't work, but I'm just gonna go for it and start swinging. That's what I did and it worked. So let's try to find the generator. Um, where is the generator? Some boss summoners. There's the generator. It all down. It is all down. Okay. That raid was a lot more difficult than I thought it was going to be, but... That's alright. That was fun. It's actually fun. I'm going to break the wall. Oh, there it goes. <laughs> Alright, anything on him? Turrets, we'll take it. We'll take all that ammo. Definitely take all that ammo. Uh, the PT. All this ammo. Fabby. That, that, that. Beautiful. Alright, why not? Weapons workbench, we'll take turrets. The metal, Ellie, paste, ammo. Uh, poly electronics, oil. Don't really need anything else out of that. Uh, metal, gunpowder, paste, LE, electronics. Yeah, you take the poly as well. Um, Alright, let's break some more stuff. Bop. Bop. Auto crafter. Okay, we'll take all of that. Gladly. Uh, the metal. The metal. Blueprint add-on. We'll take all that. Upgrade station. All of this. Augment station. Don't really need that. Don't need that. That's why I keep one out. That's not the right... Usually in my out bar. Okay. Alright, well that was a fun raid. A lot harder than I expected, I'm not gonna lie. But it was definitely fun. So, uh, I'm gonna keep scouting, keep looking around, and hopefully find some more fun bases, dude. Alright, what do we have here? Some really strange looking base, but... It's a raid! There's like no turrets on this left side. I think I can just running what 
Who just- why- why are the turrets just like, all lined together? Like, it's so strange. And all down. Alright. There was shards in the generator. You get like a hundred thousand element with the resource kit. Alright, let's get to looting. Upgrade station. Um, I will actually take all these awesome teleporters, because why not? Actually, no, I won't, because that's... I gotta transfer them, and... Yeah. Uh, we'll take this, this. Uh, these guys. Um, the feathers and the hides. The blood. Nothing out of that. I will take the dust, why not? I will take the omega eggs. I don't even think I have Omega Eggs yet, so that's kind of nice. Forge, why not? Alright. Well, that's about all I need. From there, on to the next. With some land bases raided, I headed up into the sky to start scouting. Well, hello there. I barely just saw you. Um... I should be good to just sneak up the back here. I'll try that. Hopefully I don't die. But yeah, I was flying the border on the top there and just barely... Oh, that's bad. Just barely saw this base. This bacon overlord griffin is just so overpowered. Yeah, right, let's get this generator. That's all down. Oops. Anything on you? We'll take the teleport of the alley. Cryos. Yeah, that's about all I need from you. Not gonna kill that or anything. Uh, another guy. Ellie. Vacuum's actually kind of nice. Cryos. Nothing from there. Nothing from there. Uh, we'll take the Toxic Kibble. Nothing from there. Nothing from there. Nothing from there. Take this. Nothing. Stego Egg, sure. Uh, that's a bit of a problem. I think most of their loot's in this one. I'll break this, although I think it's gonna... Yeah, if there's anything in it, it despawned. Um, shards, electronics, Ellie. Blood and hide, gunpowder, metal. So many vacuums. I will gladly take vacuum chambers all day, every day. Turrets, generator, crystal. That's all we need out of that. And, yeah, that's it. I'll leave the PT there. I wanted to leave everything, all the tames, but, yeah, they came after me, so. Alright, let's keep scouting. Alright, well, there should be a massive base coming up here in the corner. I, um, wasn't recording, but, uh, I flew into it. <laughs> at full speed, and I tried to get out, and it just did not happen. So it's in this corner somewhere. I'm being pretty cautious. Yep, there it is. That is a big 
big base. It is this guy. Interesting. I saw him talking in chat earlier. He might be online. Yeah, let's just let's just go for it. See what happens. Well, I made it on top. I definitely can get in there, especially if I can render where I'm at. If I get to the point where I'm rendering where I'm at, I'm perfect. Now this is easy peasy. I have no idea where I'm at right now. I'm going to try to fly in with the uh, bacon griffin. This is probably a stupid idea, but... Okay. That worked way too well. Oh, he logged out. Damn. He was literally just on. Okay, okay. Chill, 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 chill. It's lagging. Even, even with me inside the base and rendering everything, it's still lagging. That's wild. I gotta hurry, though. The server's gonna restart here in a second. So the server just restarted, it took me like 20 minutes to load in. We're back. The server is still shitting itself because I think all of these turrets are trying to target me through the wall or something. Uh, but let's go ahead, let's clear out these generators. And that should turn everything off. I think that's all down. Should be at least. Now let's finally get to looting. Maybe. Alright. Some weapons we'll take. Celestial helmet. Alright. I kind of need that. Um, I still have not got one. So that is. That's really nice. Uh, we'll actually take that. Um, I'm gonna knock this griffin out. Take its armor. And then... I'm gonna break all this. We'll loot through this. Um, I don't need the BPs. I got my own. Upgrade station. Metal, why not? Nothing there. So it did pop right there, which is kind of nice, but there's nothing really inside it. This guy was honestly kind of broke. He had decent stuff on his body and he had a good griffin, but other than that, that's, that's all he had. Yeah, I mean, he has a thick base, but I'll just put a few holes in it. Yeah, but that's why I would always just build, like, against the border. I'm pretty sure stuff gets broken against the border because it's technically, like, in the mesh, even though it's not in the mesh at all. Um, but just, like, it's so easy to hop on top and then go through or make a hole and go through. So, all right, we're going to keep scouting and look for another base thread. And after scouting the sky border for a bit, I found some islands that I figured would have some bases on them. There's something going on at this, uh... This island. I'm trying to figure out, I think these are all heavies. I'm gonna slowly... 
make my way down. Oh yeah, these are all heavies. That one wasn't. Whatever that, wherever that was. Ah, no, I messed up. Alright, uh, somehow I didn't die, but... Let me, uh, do that properly this time and look for the Jenny. So I'm just gonna drop straight in there, I think. Yeah. Okay. Okay, hello. This is very laggy right now. I don't know if those went off in the right spot or not. They did. But wow, this is it's like yeah, it's basically two five five. Uh, what are you doing? Stop. Go away. <laughs> Stoto's gonna get me killed. Alright, there we go. I wish the lag would subside a bit so I can try to do some stuff. Am I inside? I think so. Alright, let's get the Jenny. It's definitely ORP though. <laughs> apparently I'm just shooting everything right now. I'm still shooting apparently. I'm still shooting. <laughs> Oh my gosh. Am I still shooting? Like, what's going on here? This is so laggy. Alright, the rep will take the gunpowder, the element, the eggs. Um, take the alpha meat. The element out of the gen. Primal smithy, what do we got? Dodo egg will take it. PT will take, uh, hide and blood, take metal, some cryos, that's about all we need out of there, normal smithy, we got a poison turtle, we'll take it, why not, fabricator, metal, paste, electronics, uh, lightning scorpion, <laughs> okay, gunpowder, Gladly take, uh, refining forges, not really fussed about. Resource box. Um, nothing really there. We'll take the eggs, though. Some turrets. Um, Therizino, okay. And Abranto, thank you. Weapon workbench. I will take all that. And then, eternal workbench. Don't really need anything out of that. Alright, let's see if there's anything else on the island now that the turrets are off. Although it doesn't really look like it. So, uh, yeah, I guess we'll just keep scouting. I'm not going to break all the turrets or anything. There's no really, not really a point. I don't need the ammo, so. Yeah. Let's give this a go. There's so many turrets on this base, and we have to start so far away. But I have a plan. Hopefully it works. Alright, well. It kind of worked. It's just the server is so laggy that it's difficult <laughs> to 
you know, execute perfectly. I'm not sure if that was the same one, but... No idea what's going on right now. What is happening? What is happening? make break for the other side. I think that was a smart move. Alright, Sino. You know, please stop. Alright, I think that was from an internal, so I gotta be careful here. Okay. I might be able to make my way to that generator. I'm smart. Go this way. And it should be, like, right there. And I turned everything off in here, I believe. Okay. Tech chest. So we are inside. I'm pretty sure everything else is going to be powered on the outside, so I got to be careful. <laughs> but I do want to see if there's loot in here. And there are. There's some demonic helms. We'll take it. Um, take the metal, the force field turrets. Paste. Ellie. That's really all we need out of that. Um, guess let's pop a ceiling. Is that really all that's in here? There's all of this just for this. Well, I am. I think it might actually all be down. It is all down. So, all of this. Not only was powered by one generator but also was protecting one resource kit <laughs> are you serious okay this is so laggy right now it is 255 someone has to be raiding something huge I mean that's the raid that's <laughs> okay that's so anticlimactic because it's, they have the whole island spammed off. They got like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, seven towers. A huge cage and a big square base for one replicator. Okay. Well, that's, that's the raid. <laughs> what the heck? And now, into the ocean we go. Alright, I found a pretty wild base at a rat hole. It's got a tower, and then like another tower, and then the rat hole. So, I'm going to clear that so I can get down into that. Um, we'll see how this goes. Oh, okay. I thought those were going to be large walls, so that went surprisingly easy. Um... I don't know if the Jenny's in here. I didn't really think that through. So, uh, I think I just might do as much damage to it as I can. Alright, hold on. I'm gonna sit where I'm at right now. 
Because I can't see. <laughs> and I don't know what's going on. Oh, I got a generator. That's a good sign. Alright. And there goes the entire tower. Beautiful. Just beautiful. And it had like no ammo. Okay. Well, that took like two seconds to wipe that tower. So now this seems to be empty. Yep. Actually, I might be able to rocket as long as I keep the rockets even. Because those are so thick. Yeah. Okay. Well, I'm doing damage here, so I'm just going to keep shooting rockets until it doesn't work. Though I don't, can I just straight up shoot them? I think I can. <laughs> okay, well, I can't get that close to, <laughs> to the thing, but, um, yeah, this will work. This will work. Alright, I don't think it's going to work anymore, but, um, we can just keep in until we get the, everything. It shouldn't be too hard, we're doing a lot of damage per... We are good to go. Come on, please break. I kind of fully committed. Okay, we got one of them. There's two left. That's fine. We're still alive. Alright, there we go. Beautiful. Wow, there was literally like no ammo in any of these turrets. A decent amount of shards, but like none of that other ammo. Alright, well let's try to hit this with this. Oh, there we go, it worked. First try. That's beautiful. Is there no... Why did you not build the rat hole? What? Why? I'm so confused, man. Why would you not... Oh, uh, people confuse me so much. Well, there's a knocked out griffin down here. I don't think that's a good sign. Did someone already raid this? I feel like there's a chance someone already raided this. Although, I don't know. Let's see, is there any loot in here? I mean, there is... All the structures are still here. Let's pop open everything, I guess. Weapons workbench. Okay. There is a full set of celestial BPs. We don't actually need those, but I'm taking them anyway. <laughs> uh, we'll take all of this ammo. Gladly take all this ammo. I'll actually take that tech bow BP as well. I don't really want the flamethrowers. We'll take that. 
Um, at that, the weapons. Um, grapples, alpha egg, hide, fabled egg, some blood, some ammo, some hides, electronics, blood. I will take all of that griffin armor gladly and take this. These guys seem to actually have some decent stuff, so that is amazing. <laughs> um, beautiful weapons, armor, pre-crafted saddles, radiator armor, celestial armor. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Um, what is it? What are these? Bacon Overlord Griffins. We will gladly take all of those. And there's a bunch of tack bullets, but I'm not going to take those just yet. But I think I will eventually. Torch. Okay. So much good stuff. Celestial armor. Weapons. Just a bunch of consumables. We'll take all these origin tributes. Celest or creator armor. Celestial. Ammo, more celestial. Oh wait, these aren't these are eternal. I don't want eternal. Uh what is this? An XB out that's let's just keep getting better and better. I needed an XBL. <laughs> let's take the weapons and the celestial and the weapon. That was a good smithy. <laughs> Alright. Take the element. Thing really else from there. I already looted that. And then the replicator. And that just has some element in it. Alright. Um let's get all the bullet pluses. I can't really do that, can I now? Uh AP. Yeah, that will work. Beautiful. That was actually a really good raid. That was a really good raid. They had a couple griffins in the next BL, but not too many cryos, but they also had a lot of weapons and a lot of good armor. That is amazing. All right, I have no idea what's going on in this base, but uh, we're gonna figure it out. Doesn't look like it the wall is super big, so might be able to make something happen here. I think I'm actually gonna put the rockets there. Try to get close. Yeah, we might just have to try to I don't know. Just straight up rocket run or something. Okay, well I got the gate first try. Alright, now let's try to get through the gate. We'll try to tech rifle and get through the gate. There's like a second- Oh my god, there's so much to this base. Why is there so much? Alright, I need to like clean out the first little bit so then I can work on the next bit. All right, well, we're making progress now. Alright, 
There we go. That's progress. Now we just need to get into the next section, and I think I might be able to just cheese this by... Uh, that's not ideal, but... <laughs> Maybe opening up a, uh, a hole in the wall there, and then going through that hole in the wall, rather than having to deal with all of this. Come on. Might be doing too much damage, to be honest. Okay. Now I just need to get up there, so if I can just... No. Where am I? Okay, this is fine. Let's just, uh... Can I fit? Oh! No, but what I can do is just... Break enough holes in the wall so I can. And we are in. Okay. That was, uh, stressful. And you are on aggressive. Of course you are. Instead of Velo shooting me, it is. Go to sleep. Alright, where's the generator? Let me get that dealt with. Alright, what do we got? We got a... The Reaper from the bosses. A Spirit Manticore, very nice. A PT. Um, that's all eternal, don't need that. We'll take the Griffin Armor. Take this, take this, take this. Beautiful. Now let's actually put our weapons back in the right places. Drop the implants. Okay. What do we got? Mutator, element, auto crafter, replicator, nanny. Don't need any of that. Primal smithy. Um, don't really need any of that. Let's go ahead and break some more stuff. Replicator, a bunch of shards. We don't need to take those. We'll just take the element. And everything else in there is pretty not needed. Um, don't really need it. Actually, we'll take the normal narcotic. Why not? Uh, let's break this stuff. What do we got? Shards, Ellie. Take the gunpowder. Cooker. Don't need that. Alright, what do we got? Bunch of wyvern eggs we'll gladly take. A collector. Take all of those. And a bunch more wyvern eggs. There it is. Is that everything? And turn it off? It definitely didn't turn it off. Okay. Uh, maybe here. Nope. Okay. I guess I'm going outside. All right. Well, we got everything out. I'll just get my body and leave. <laughs> and with our fun on Lost Island coming to an end, I headed back to Ragnarok. I think just going straight for the gate and trying to go in might be the best play here. Yeah, I'm just going to do that.
Well, that was a little chaotic. I think I'm going to put the rocket launcher in there and then try to go with the rocket launcher. Alright, well, I think we got the gates done. I don't know if we made a hole, but the gates are gone. Ah, uh, come on. Let me through. Are we good? I think we're good. I'm gonna break this cloning chamber. Give me some space to walk around. Alright, the generator's in there. We should be able to break through this. That is all down. Alright. That was easy enough. Um, what is that? Why was it invisible? What? Can they go invisible? Is that like a thing for fabled griffins? It's so quick. Just let me knock you out. I don't want to kill you. Thank you. It's a prime griffin. Alright. Alright, let's see. What does he have on him? A uh, bunch of element. And a bunch of grapples. Don't really need anything else. Cloning chamber, take the shards, why not? Alright, and then let's, let's go ahead and break everything. I love this torch so much. This torch makes things so much fun. Alright, what do we got? I'll take the meat, why not? I don't even think I've cooked meat in the base at all, so... Gladly take that. Vaults. Um, take this. We're in home server now too, so I don't have to transfer it off map. That is beautiful. We'll take these walls. Take the turrets and the force field. Everything else. We'll take the foundations too. Um, bottom vault. Uh, we'll just take all that. Why not? Uh, bunch of ammo. That is beautiful. We'll take all that and just put it straight into our turrets at home. Weapon workbench, nothing. Tech rep, just Ellie. Okay. Soul terminal. Bunch of PTs. We'll gladly take them, why not? And the mutator, just Ellie. Uh, looks like there's an upstairs. Let me put my tech chest on. Go upstairs. I did break the staircase. Trying to get the tech bubble. Ooh. These stairs are so weird. Alright, there we go. Alright. Uh. Ah, it's just the roof. Okay. Well, I'm not gonna break the base. There's no point. Yeah, I won't do that. Although, I do think his turrets are capped, but... That's alright. I'm not gonna break his base. If he wants to come back, they are definitely not capped. Okay. If he wants to come back, you always have the option to. Alright. Well, let's pick up our fob and keep scouting. Oh, no, 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 no. Okay. Um. Is the top open? I'm just gonna fly in. Uh, okay. <laughs> Very strange. It's like half built, kind of confused. Anybody sleeping or anything? No sleepers. Let's loot. Start looting from over here, and then we'll make our way over. Mini vault full of shards and ARB. I'll take the ARB. Um, I literally just don't need the shards, and this is full of ammo as well. Oh my gosh. 
Yeah, I just don't need shards. I have so much Ellie that I can just Instacraft in the shards. It's not even funny. And my turrets are full too, so like, I don't need them. But we'll take this, this, this. Vacuum compartments always. This. Um, electronics. Metal. That's all we need out of that. Auto crafter. Ellie. Rep. Electronics. Metal. There was lagging. Alright. And then all of this. Beautiful. Primal Smithy is very full. Uh, hide feathers. Don't need the artifacts. Um, tribute. Hide. Boss Essence. The Souls. Tribute. Blood. Demonic Hide. Kibble. Uh, the capped weapon. PT. I was <laughs> named. Those confused. Uh, demonic kibble. Jenny egg. Soul. TP. I don't need that. That's not capped. Hide. Blood. Item blood. Hide. And then all these turrets. And the Jenny. All right. Soul Terminal, just one Demonic Equus, okay, I'll take it. And then I think that's everything, because there was nothing in these. Yeah, I mean, not not a bad raid, to be honest. A lot of ammo. Um, I'll finish the cap on shards, I guess, because why not? I don't need them, per se, but we'll take them. And that was it. I had raided 16 bases in 24 hours, and figured that after all that, it was time to call it for the season. I had done everything I could think of and dominated the server, but I still have a lot to learn. And who knows, maybe next time I'll bring my full tribe to Primal Fear and see how it goes.